what's going on, Dodgers Nation? Doug McCain here. You can follow me on Twitter and Instagram at DMAC underscore LA. A masterful performance by Walker Buehler. I'm going to tell you why the best is yet to come for Butane. We're going to get to that in just a second. But quick reminder for all latest Dodgers news rumors, hype videos, interviews, breakdowns, and more. Be sure to hit that subscribe button. Hit that notification bell. And if you want to see us post even more Dodgers content, smash that like button. It really helps out the channel. And as always, I'm with your takes down below in the comment section. Today's Dodgers Nation question of the day. Do you think the best is yet to come for Walker Buehler? And also, describe his outing last night in three words or less. Let me know down below. And for all the latest Dodgers news, head over to DodgersNation.com. A signature performance last night from Walker F.N. Buehler. Butane throws his first complete game in his career and the first complete game in Major League Baseball this season. It feels like seven is the new nine in the bigs, but last night, Walker Buehler goes the distance. He allows no runs on three hits, had 10 punches through nine innings of work, 108 pitches total for Buehler, and you can see after the eighth inning, the way he walked into that Dodgers dugout, there was no way he he was coming out of that game. He told Dave Roberts that he was staying in the game, that he wasn't coming out. You saw him sniffing those smelling salts, taking that sip of water, and he goes out there and he finishes the job for the first time in his career. And Bueller, coming into the last night's game, he hadn't gone past five and two-thirds innings in his first three starts, but you saw throughout the game, no stress, wasn't laboring. He was commanding all of his pitches. He was still hitting 96 on the gun in the ninth inning, so it made perfect sense to keep him out there, allow him to reach this milestone for the first time in his career. And yes, it was the, and yes, and yes, it was the lowly Diamondbacks, the team with the worst batting average in the league at 185, the second worst OPS at 593. But Bueller didn't allow a base runner to advance to third all night long, and he still was very dominant out there on the mountain. Dave Roberts, he said after the game, and then Dave Roberts said after the game that that's as well as he's ever seen Walker Buehler pitch. Doc told reporters, I think there have been outings where you might have seen more velocity or it looks or is perceived as more dominant, but I thought tonight was as well pitched of a game as he's pitched in the big leagues. I really believe that. And I really agree with Dave Roberts because I think moving forward, this is the formula for Walker Buehler. If you look at his outing last night, if you look at his pitch mix, you saw 33% four-seam fastballs and his fastball velo was up 0.8 percent average 95.4 miles per hour it topped out at 96.8 miles per hour on the year he's averaging 94.6 miles per hour but you saw the effectiveness with that curveball he threw it at a 26 percent clip he got four whiffs on it 16 swings but he had some movement in the zone he was creating a lot of soft contact also you saw the cutter he got three swings and misses with that cutter threw it at a 23 percent clip you saw him use that change up 10 percent of the time get four swings and miss he got two swings and miss with that slider which he threw six percent of the time and also threw that sinker so he's a much more dynamic pitcher in 2022 than we've ever seen he's not heavily reliant on that four seam fastball like we've seen in years past when he's trying to get hitters to chase at the top of the zone trying to elevate that fastball and throw a pass guys and yes he's still gonna have that in that bag because his fastball is special even if you're seeing a little bit of diminished velocity. It's the late life on his heater, and it is the command. Command is king for pitchers. Command greater than sign velocity. That's how I look at it. And when it comes to Walker Buehler, we've seen him just dominate hitters. We've seen him dominate hitters like in the 2020 postseason, in the 2018 postseason, where he goes out there, he's pumping 99 and 100. We also seen him get into some trouble in those outings, load the bases, walk a few hitters, give up a home run or two. This Walker Buehler is more conducive to sustained success. If you look at his home run to fly ball percentage this year, it's at 7.1%. That's a career low. Last year, that number sat at 10.1%, and in 2020, it was at 17.9%. So he's becoming a different pitcher. He's evolving. He's maturing, and you love to see it. And I think the best days are ahead of Walker Buehler. And yes, he still has that adrenaline. Yes, when he still wants to bring it and throw a pass, guys, he's going to have that in his bag. But I think he realized at this stage of his career that keeping hitters off balance with his breaking stuff and commanding his fastball in the zone, that's 
that's the formula for success for Walker Buehler. And I think he's definitely going to put himself in the Cy Young mix this season. And if you saw me on the Dodgers Nation roundtable when we discussed Walker Buehler, what I say, I said that Walker Buehler was affected by the short and spring training, that he was a pitcher that's gotten off to some slow starts in his career. And then also he was learning to pitch where he's not as heavily reliant on that four seam fastball. And you saw that on display last night with the increased use of the curveball, of the cutter, of the slider and less fastball last night that he was still going to be one of the best pitchers in all of Major League Baseball. But after the game, Walker Buehler, he talked about his big night down in Arizona, why it was such a big accomplishment for him to throw his first complete game and everything that went into putting together his best start of the season. Uh, Will did a great job of, of steering me through it and threw a lot more curveballs than we have been and, and kind of got us back on track. So um, a good night and, and offense got us going early. So. Uh, made my job a little easier. Just kind of a, another milestone that, that I wanted and, and something that I think is, you know, beneficial for our team and, uh, yeah, it's exciting. Uh, you know, a lot of work by, by our, our guys in there from, from coaching to strength to medical to, you know, the analytics and, and research people trying to figure out what's kind of been wrong with me. So uh, we figured some stuff out and, and hopefully we can stay on track. Uh, yeah, I mean, it's weird to say a, a little, the, the last thing wasn't as good as, as I wanted. So. Uh, you know, it's, it's a cool accomplishment and, and a cool win for our team. So congrats on the big night, Butane, your first complete game of your career in your 98th start. The question is, will he throw more complete games this season? Because no National League pitcher has thrown more than one complete game in a season since Clayton Kershaw did it back in 2016. It was the first complete game by a Dodger since Hunjin Ryu's shutout back in 2019. So Walker, F, and Bueller, this guy is a dog. I love the demeanor. I love the mindset. You're not taking him out of that game. Give me some smelling salts, and we're going to finish this damn thing. But let me know down below in the comment section, do you think the best is yet to come for Walker Buehler? Me, I definitely think it is. He's gone from being a thrower to a pitcher. He's one of the most intelligent players in the game, and he wants to be great, and that's exactly what he is. But let me know down below in the comment section. Also, describe his outing last night in three words or less. Let me know down below. My name is Doug McCain. You can follow me on Twitter and Instagram at DMAC underscore LA. For all latest Dodgers, news, rumors, hype videos, interviews, breakdowns and more be sure to hit that subscribe button hit that notification bell and if you want to see us post even more dodgers content smash that like button and as always think blue bleed blue and i'm out